Hi guys, this is Organo and Common Creature and we are naming cycloalkanes. So, the name cycloalkane implies that these are alkanes but in a cyclic ring structure. So, they've got a general formula of CnH2n. Now, this general formula is the same formula that is uh, used for alkenes. The reason is in cycloalkanes, each terminal carbon atom is joined to one another through a covalent bond because of which each carbon atom will lose one hydrogen atom. So the formula of alkane being CnH2n plus 2, if you remove two hydrogen atoms, the remaining formula is CnH2n, which is similar to that of alkene. So in order to make cycloalkanes, the least number of carbon atoms required is 3. So the first cycloalkane is a 3-carbon ring structure known as cyclopropane. Now in this structure, each carbon atom is bonded by two hydrogen atoms. So the molecular formula of cyclopropane is C3 and H6. The next compound in the cycloalkane homologous series contains four carbon atoms. And each carbon atom will be bonded to two hydrogen atoms. So the compound would be CH2, 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 CH2. And a bond here completes the ring, forming a compound with the molecular formula C4H8. And the name of this compound is cyclobutane. The third compound in the homologous series of cycloalkanes contains five carbon in a cyclic ring, each carbon bonded to two hydrogen atoms. So CH2, 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 and CH2. This forms a compound with the molecular formula C5H10, having a name of cyclopentane. The next compound in the cycloalkane homologous series consists of six carbon atoms attached to two hydrogen atoms each in a cyclic ring, forming a six-membered carbon ring, and the name of which is cyclohexane. The molecular formula of this compound is C6. H12, as can be seen from the drawn structure.